Exploring more than just golden fighting fish, the aquarium at the Orange Coast College, located in the new Lewis Building, invites you to discover all types of different fascinating species. Dennis Kelly, I'm the director of the Orange Coast College Aquarium. The Orange Coast College Aquarium has been in existence since the 1960s when they built the Lewis Center for Applied Science. And so with the opening of the new Lewis Center, uh, not only do we have bigger laboratories, we have two laboratories instead of one, we now have a, a giant aquarium room compared to the one we did have and much, much larger tanks. We have sumps below the aquariums that hold quite a bit of water too. And the more water you have, the more you can dilute down any waste that goes into the water from the fish. And your filters and all that do a really good job removing waste, but if it's diluted down, there's less chance it's gonna kill animals. So we have a warm water tropical aquarium, and we display not only tropical fish, but invertebrates, and we even have a live coral reef tank. And the coral reef tank was probably the most ambitious thing we ever tried, and also the most successful. And basically what you recreate is a living coral reef like you would see uh, at the Great Barrier Reef or maybe somewhere off Mexico or something like that. We have uh, several systems in the aquarium. Uh, the one that we're looking at is a rack system and typically this kind of system will be found uh, in companies where they're raising animals for research purposes. Right now we're dealing with a lot of animals that would be typically seen in uh, home aquariums or um, public viewing aquariums. So the students really can get a broad spectrum of inputs and uh, experiences in the aquarium class. If the students put the time and effort into the aquariums and the fish and the animals that they've chosen, then they can see the results immediately, as can the rest of the, the campus. So it's a class that has a really unique aspect where the students drive what's going on as opposed to being fed information. The aquarium was unveiled on Science Night to the public, especially for children in the Costa Mesa area to come and explore the different types of fish and the inner workings of the aquarium. Therefore, this is only the beginning. Soon there will be new attractions, and due to student involvement, it will continue to grow. And eventually there will be many other exotic species, including jellyfish to experiment and explore.